Okay, the problem with the square root 2 is we can't have a square root in the denominator. So what we're going to have to do is we're going to have to rationalize the denominator. By doing that, I can multiply this top and the bottom by square root 2. Now by doing that, I'm going to multiply through. I'll actually do it down here. This is going to be 5 square root 2 times square root 2 times square root 2. And we know that square root 2 times square root 2 is going to be, anybody? Well, it's going to be 2. Okay, why is that? Because I know that square root 2 times square root 2 is the same thing as square root 2 squared, which is just 2. Okay, but back up here, we know that 5 square root 2 remains the same, and this is our final answer for what y equals. It equals 5 square root 2 all divided by 2. Hope you can read that too. It's a little bit messy. Thank you very much.